if you want, you can check out my Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook page. I do post minor trips and other things that I don't always post to YouTube. If you want to follow those, uh, it's more real time. It takes a little while to edit videos before I post them. But uh, we're going to do a gumbo. Stay tuned for the striper gumbo. Yeah, this is just going to get stuck. A cast master with a single hook doesn't uh, doesn't get caused much so we're gonna have to have to use that one right now unless we find a spot where there's no seaweed so we'll put the cast master on got to fish the conditions presented to you so it's just the way it is I'll keep walking though it might be some uh, spots where there's no seaweed I want to try this spot here first man uh, let's just see how much seaweed I pick up here I like the way the water is breaking here but a lot of seaweed all right we're gonna have to move because that's what's out there right there that's it all right let's get it in I don't think it's gonna break off on me but it's just getting worse and worse a little bit better here it's not too bad right here I think I might stay here for a second I think over there I don't see any seaweed so basically we're just searching for spots where there's no seaweed or less seaweed right here there's less seaweed doing short casts if I cast too far it's gonna get seaweed or more seaweed. Dude, did I just get a fish? Dude, how did I just get a fish like that? Wow, dude, I can't believe it. I was just laying it like fumble around <laughs> I got one I don't know if it's a striper or not though it's not fighting hard it's not fighting too hard yeah it's a striper Woo! oh god dude oh yeah he's not bad I just don't want him to get any seaweed come on man don't get in the seaweed buddy oh yeah it's a striper I see him I see him man yeah don't come off just depends on how well i have them hooked here waves are pushing them a little hard so i want to be careful with them all right not too bad not too bad Woo, buddy come on striper Woo. all right come on come on buddy yes all right he's a keeper oh he's bleeding it's not good but he hit it weird dude he hit it so weird oh man in the mouth man all right that time i was letting it drop i paused it and i let it drop oh barely but we got him man he's fat too he's a fat one all right, just whoa, buddy. Whoa, I know, I know, buddy. Chill. I'll put you out. I'll put you out, buddy. Woo! He's got a lot of energy. A lot. Still a lot of energy. All right, zero. Oh, it's not too bad. He's almost 23, 22 and a half. We'll just call it 22. lead them out I was about to say let's see if we can get another one but now there's a bunch of seaweed here on the paws on the drop man that's when he grabbed it interesting so usually what happens is uh when i pause it, it starts to drop and then when i start to reel again that's usually when they hammer it but this time he he got it when it was going down and it's just so much seaweed man 
This is the only thing I have that doesn't get stuck on it as easily. Got to use it. Got to use it, man. I don't have to throw it that far. They're close. I'm going to tighten the drag a little bit here. So I had to play around with my drag because of the seaweed. It's too tight. Depending on how I hooked it, it might just pull them right off or break my line. And if it's too loose, it could get wrapped in more seaweed. And I'll never get them in, so just kind of have to find that balance. Normally, you want to leave your drag set though and leave it that way if it's clear conditions and the waves are normal. But today, it's just not normal. I got him at peak low tide, man. That's when you hit it. Gonna have to move soon. That's a lot of seaweed coming this way. Oh, the way the water's breaking. Come on. Oh, man. You can tell sometimes fish are probably gonna be like running up by the way the water's breaking. It looked good right there, but I didn't get nothing. We're gonna move, man. Look at those chunks. Chunks. Gotta get past it. Three other guys left because of all the seaweed. Come on, striper. Come on, boy. I need one more. Woo wee. All right. It's all good. It's all good. I got one. It's got a little flat here. I might be able to avoid the seaweed. Let's give it a shot. Uh, it looks worse here to be honest. I thought it was going to be better, but I think it's worse. Really wanted to throw that lucky crap. It'd be a good spot to throw it if it wasn't for the seaweed, man. I see a lot of sand crabs here. Usually on flats like this, when waves come in like this, a swell, fish will come up with it too to get the sand crabs that are washing out. Caught a lot of fish like that. Time to move, man. Uh, too much seaweed, man. I'm trying to find a spot where there's no seaweed. Ooh, it's thick, dude. Thick. Got seaweed, dude. Man, nothing but seaweed chunks, man. That's all I see. I should have stayed where I was. Not really any better out here. But we'll see. Got a little trough right here. I can see it in the water. Oh! <laughs> I saw two. You, you can't see them on the camera, but I saw two stripers following this in the water. They were chasing it down, man. They were chasing it down. Just little baby stripers, but they might be some bigger ones here. I'm gonna try to get my camera down a little bit here. And I didn't see him that time. But yeah, I had two little baby stripers, man. Get out there a little farther. Maybe he's got a bigger one. Might have a bigger one. Uh, I'll do this one really slow, see what happens. I'm kinda gonna jig it a little bit here. Huh, interesting. That was cool to see, man. That was really cool. Go a little faster this time. Figure there might be a bigger one that would take it, but I wonder if they saw me and I spooked them. They were close, man. Ugh. We moved. Heading back now. I'm gonna try this one, dental floss. The uh, treble hook's probably gonna get caught in seaweed more than a single hook, but it's not too much right here, so we'll give it a shot. I think this is a half ounce, maybe, maybe a quarter ounce. I can't remember, but we'll give it a shot. All right, for this one, I'm gonna loosen the drag a little bit. That'll probably work. This one to catch surf perch. It's 
still throw it pretty far. Yeah. That's why I didn't want to throw it. These treble hooks, they just, they'll grab everything out there. Uh, I might have to switch it back. Yeah, not really a day to throw something like this. I don't think the seaweed is as bad, so I'm gonna give a, I'm gonna give this a shot. Hopefully the seaweed doesn't take it. All right, dental floss. It kind of flattens out like that, but in the water when it shakes, it kind of spreads out. Eh, working okay, I guess. Ah, no seaweed. Good, good. Might have a chance. Got a good feeling about this spot with this guy. Want a little, a little tighter here. That'll work. Gotta be a big striper out there. It looks too good. Water right there. Yes! Yes! All right! Let's land him. Let's land him, dude. I didn't think I was going to get another one. Yes! Drag's about where I want it. Drag's about where I want it. All right. Let's get him in. It's a good one. I'll loosen it a little bit here because he's... Oh, yeah. He's a good one. He's a good one. It's a good striper here. All right. Come on. Come on, Daddy. He's a good one. Yeah. Might be the waves, but he's a good one. I don't want to lose him. Come on, man. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Woo. All right. All right. Come on. Oh, yeah. He's a good one. He is a good one, dude. Woo. A lot of pushback with the waves, though. Oh, don't come off on me, man. Don't come off. All right. Yeah. All right, come on, wave. Come on, wave. Uh, I'm trying to get him in. It's hard. It's hard with the waves like this. Uh. All right, there we go. Come on, come on, come on. Don't come off. Oh, yes, yes. Uh. All right. Yeah. Nice one. Uh-oh. Alright, dude. Alright. Oh, dude. Chill. Chill for me, man. Chill for me, man. Alright. Alright. That's a good striper. I think this is the biggest one I ever got, but look. Gotta let him go. Got him on the outside. Can't keep him on the outside. Alright. I think that's my biggest one, though. I'm measuring right quick because I think he's my biggest one. All right. Measure him. Yeah, 23. 23 inches. The biggest one. All right, let's let him go. Woo, woo, chill. Don't, don't, don't wear yourself out, man. Get you back out there, buddy. All right. Yeah, he's, got, he's feisty. Yeah, he had plenty, plenty of energy. He's good. All right. Nice. Yeah. Two stripers, man. That's my personal best. 23 inches. On the cast master again. All right, man. Yeah. Whew. Coast Guard. In the chopper, man.
was really good. The fish, I let it just kind of sit on top and soak in. I didn't want it to break apart and just become mush in it. So I just kind of left it intact and put it on the top. And I let it sit for like 10 minutes. Uh, if I dated it again, I would probably use a whole package. I didn't use all of it. Um, it makes it a little bit thicker. Uh, you could add flour too and that will thicken it up. I mean, it depends on how you like it, but it was still good. Thank you for watching. Next time.